welcome to F1 Podcast. Well, since our last video where we were talking a little bit about this two-tier uh, World Championship situation, the budget cap that uh, Mosley and his cronies are talking about introducing, um, there's been a, a little bit of feedback from you know BMW, Ferrari, um, also Toyota. And all three of them aren't really happy with this situation, as as we aren't, as I'm sure you know a lot. Well, a lot of you guys have said you're not happy about. And Max, the big one for me was Toyota, basically saying we're not going to sign up for this in in 2010. If this is the way that the championship's going to go, mm -hmm. then we're, we're not going to do it. Well, they got until the 29th of May to make their decision, buddy, mm -hmm. and that's coming up pretty quick. When you think about it, the three teams in question build road cars. Uh, and they have a reputation to uphold, and I can't really argue with them. I wouldn't, uh, if I was uh, a BMW, for example, uh, or a BMW uh, Formula One team, I wouldn't want uh, potentially a uh, uh, a Formula One team like a, a Lola or a, a Penske or a uh, <laughs> Andretti Green, Andretti Green <laughs> or whatever, uh, with half the cap of me beating me on the grid. Yeah. That's not going to really do too good for my sales, so I can't uh, I, I can't say I blame uh, these guys for uh, for being upset about it. Uh, yeah, we've made our feelings known on the two tier system, and uh, and let's hope that uh, common sense prevails. I think a lot of fans uh, of Formula One have turned around uh, through various forums and the like, and have made mention uh, that they're not uh, particularly happy uh, with a two tier system. Mm. And if the FOA to be to be believed, a lot of their decision making is based on fan input. Um, hopefully, they'll listen to us this time. Yeah, the FOA. <coughs> sorry, excuse me. The FOA will, uh, you know, as they've done in the past, they will put these things out there. You know, let's hark back to the medals debacle recently, Max, where they said there was going to be medals and things, and then oh, sorry, we didn't mean to put that into the regulations. Wasn't that funny? Just the mega. Mega backflip. I mean, the it's FAA, great. in my mind, is just known for their backflips and known for making outrageous statements and then say, oh, sorry, sorry, we didn't actually mean that. Yeah, you did mean it. Yeah. And you thought that we'd just go along with it, and we didn't, and <laughs> you've done a backflip. All right, let's just cut the chase. That's what happened. But it's not just the teams, Max, as well. It's drivers like Kimmy who are saying, well, this, I think the quote he made was, this isn't Formula One, and I don't know whether I want to continue racing, uh, you know, in a, in a championship that's built like this. It's giving medals away and having a two-tier system. Mm. Yeah, I wouldn't want to race in it either. Yeah. Well. And do you think, uh, mate, just, just on that note, um, do you think that Jensen Button's uh, performance this year has had any anything to do with the whole, maybe rethink of the whole medal thing next year? I mean, he's won three out of the first four races and he's in pole position for the fourth out of the fifth race. Yeah, and, and you know, he could... Under that system, he could wrap up the championship in a couple of races' time because no one's really going to get that number of wins, um, uh, you know, under their belt. And you've had the last two championships go down to the wire, and mm. they've been very exciting finishes. You Both know, one by one point. Yeah, a couple of you know, a couple of championships, one point, and so you know, why mess with that? You know, maybe the points could be changed slightly, but. The, it's just ridiculous that they've made these uh, assertions, Max, and they're, they're backflip back from them. And um, what they need to do now is work with the, the big teams who are actually creating the sport for them. Yeah. Uh, those ones who, you know, as Toyota said, we've been good uh, corporate citizens in F1, and uh, and work yeah. with them. And, and and Fota needs to be more involved, I think, Max. Yeah, and Fota are getting a more and more of a voice now, which is fantastic, and uh, and hopefully that will. Uh, that will continue. Alright guys, well that's our thoughts on the issues, so leave us a comment and let us know what you think. Alright guys, enjoy the race, we'll see you next time. See you guys. Bye. Bye.